Hello and welcome. In this video, I will explain the objective function of game networks. The objective function of a generative adversarial network looks like this. Min, max. Well, the generator will try to minimize and the discriminator will try to maximize this function. And uh, I will come to the explanation. Well, the e value of the x plotted to x probability log of discriminator output plus z map z distribution log of uh, 1 minus d g z so let me first of all explain what dx means well x in this function is the real data the real training data for example if we have images as an inputs then x is the real image data and the discriminator function will take this real data as an input and the output will between zero and one right if the output of the dx is equal to one that means that the real data taken by the discriminator function has high one output that means that the discriminator thinks that the input is real on the other hand if the output is zero well the discriminator thinks that the input is fake and not real so this is what dx means the generator function gz on the other hand takes z as uh, randomized as an input and it will try to output a value an image that is fake in reality but our job and purpose is to fool the discriminator fool the discriminator discriminator well initially the z is a random noise taken as an input by the generator function and its output is an image or any value in this case if i take the example as an image then the image would be a fake one and the discriminator will catch it but the training process will keep on continue until the generator generates an image that does not look like fake but looks like a real one so at, at this stage the generator will fool successfully the discriminator but you know in this gan network this is why we call it as an adversarial network because there is a battle between the discriminator function and the generator function the generator tries to output samples that look like real ones and the discriminator tries to classify the outputs of the generator as fake one so this is a battle between these two functions and the mathematical function that i wrote over here mathematically explain that right so let me come to the mathematical function again 
min max the discriminator try to maximize this function so it tries to maximize this term and it tries to maximize this term the discriminator well in this case the dx is high because the real uh, values taken by the the real uh, data taken by the discriminator function as an input definitely has a high it has a high output and a high output means just like in this case the data is real so the discriminator tries to maximize this one in this term the discriminator tries to minimize this d gz right d gz it tries to minimize this one right if this term approaches to zero or is equal to zero this means that the discriminator has successfully classified its input which in this case is the generator output sample it has successfully classified it as fact so when the discriminator output in this case b g is equal to zero it thinks that the generator output is fact one so log of one minus zero in this case log one is equal to zero so this is the result of this term will be zero which means it is higher compared to some very high negative value and when will that high negative value come when the d gz is equal to one okay so this is very interesting let me explain it this value d gz will be one when the generator output which is input in this discriminator function has been classified as real one that the generator output is real enough so that the discriminator has been fooled the discriminator believes that the generator output which is the input of the discriminator is a real one fooled to believe that the generator output is real so in at this point this term will become one and one minus one zero log of zero some very high negative value so as a result this term is minimized and uh, this overall term in fact is minimized so this is how the generator the generator tries to minimize this objective function and the discriminator tries to maximize this just like uh, in uh, when the discriminator was able to classify the output of the generators fake this term resulted in zero which is definitely higher compared to very high negative value when the d gz was one and the discriminator was fooled so this is how the battle continues between the discriminator and generator the generator minimize this function by fooling the discriminator to believe that its output is real one or, or looks like real to be very specific or precise looks like real and hence this term will result in a very high negative value so definitely less than zero so this overall objective function result will be minimized so the battle of uh, adversary between the discriminator and the generator continues like this so if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section thank you for watching the video